Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to increase your FPS and boost performance in Counter-Strike 2 no matter what setup you're using. Whether you're running on a low-end PC or just want smoother gameplay, I've got you covered with in-game settings, console commands, system tips, and more. Let's get into it. Now let's enable the Steam FPS counter so you can actually see your FPS on screen and track your improvements. Here's how to do it. Press Shift plus Tab while in-game. In the Steam overlay, click the Settings, the gear icon. Go to the in-game tab. Look for In-game FPS counter. Set it to top left corner or wherever you prefer. You can also check the box that says High Contrast Color to make it easier to see. Now you'll have a live FPS counter showing while you play. Let's start with the best in-game settings for performance. Open CS2, then go to Settings, Video, and apply the following. Display Mode. Set this to full screen resolution. Use your monitor's native resolution, or lower it slightly for a boost. Global Shadow Quality. Set this to Low Model, Texture Detail, Low or Medium Texture. Filtering Mode, set to Bilinear Shader. Detail, Low Boost Player. Contrast, on multi-core rendering, enabled MSAA anti-aliasing, none, off. FXAA anti-aliasing, off weight for vertical sync, V-sync, off motion. Blur, off triple monitor mode, off use. Uber shaders, disabled. Once you've made these changes, click Apply at the bottom right. These changes alone can give you a solid 10 to 30 FPS boost, especially if you're on integrated graphics or a low-end GPU. Let's move on to some developer console commands to further boost performance. Make sure the developer console is enabled. Go to Settings Game, Enable Developer Console, and then set this to Yes. Then press the tilde key, usually under ESQI, to open the console. Now type in these commands one by one. FPS max zero. Now CL show FPS one. And for optional command if you still suffer from stuttering engine low, latency, sleep, after client. Tick true, this command may not be activated if you reopen CS2 again. So you have to put this one outside the game in properties, settings in Steam. If your game is still installed on a hard drive, HDD, moving it to an SSD can help reduce load times stuttering, and boost overall performance. To move the game, go to Steam Library, right-click Counter-Strike 2, click Properties, go to Installed Files, click on Move Install Folder, select your SSD drive and hit Move. Next, let's free up RAM by closing unnecessary background apps. Press Coral plus Shift MIDI plus ESC, to open Task Manager under the Processes tab, look for apps like Chrome, Spotify, Discord right-click, and click End Task on anything you don't need while gaming. This gives CS2 more memory and CPU to work with. As a bonus tip, let's delete junk files from your system. Press Windows plus R, type 
press enter delete all files in that folder. Then do the same with temp and prefetch. It won't directly boost FPS, but it helps your system run cleaner and smoother. And that's it. You, you now know how to boost your FPS in CS2, even with a low-end setup. We covered the best settings, Steam FPS overlay, console tweaks, SSD transfer, and RAM saving tips. If this helped you get more frames, be sure to like the video, subscribe, and drop a comment with how much FPS you gained. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you in the next one.